Hey everybody, I decided to make a little video about my scanning tool, Actron CP 9580. I got it after uh, doing some reviews and I just want to share all, all its functions in case somebody else is interested. It's a great little tool. It has a code connect function with 3.6 million fixes verified by AAC mechanics. If your car is in the scan tool, then it's going to tell you the code connect is available. It also got an ABS connect and diagnostics and erase. So let's see what we got. You got the vehicle diagnostics, review data, print data, system setup. In the system setup, we got everything from English to metric. I used to, uh, I like to use a metric because it's more accurate. Contrast, auto power off, quick test, print language setup, uh, tool information, display test. Keep it memory test program mode. Okay, so let's go. We go to vehicle diagnostics. If you just want to do a quick test, you just, uh, go to global OBD2. But you got the domestic vehicles, the European, Asian, and this is a this is my mom's car. She got a '98 Sable station wagon. So I go to domestic. It's gonna ask you for a year. Go down to 2098. It's a car. You go to Mercury. Sable. Engine is 3.0. It's going to ask you if, if it's equipped with the ABS. You should pull yes. Okay, the key is off. So now I'm going to put it into on position. Gonna push enter and see what it's gonna show. Not all supported monitor states are completed. Push enter. It's gonna tell you since the last time I cleared the DTCs because I always got a P0455 code popping up. It doesn't have no vacuum leak, it doesn't have, uh, I, I tested the solenoid, everything is good, so it's the gas cap, so I don't, I'm not worried about it. Misfire monitor, okay, fuel system monitor, okay, component, okay, catalyst still incomplete, EVAP not complete, oxygen sensor, okay, oxygen sensor heater, okay, EGR system monitor, okay, okay, now it goes, P0455. If a periodic emission system leak detected, gross leak, no flow, it's still pending. That's gonna show you the ABS codes, no codes, global one code. So now we go back, you go to, you can either go to read codes again, and global, ABS, all, 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 of, all of it. Then you got the erase codes, uh, malfunction indi indication lamp should be off if the engine is running. Okay, it's, it's off. State OBD check. It's saying mill status off, codes found zero. We got one code, but it's still pending. Monitors okay, it's six, and monitors incomplete, two. View data, it's gonna ping all the sensors that are available in the car. And you just go to entire data list. It's gonna show you everything, yeah. Total position sensor, engine speed, calculated low, measure flow sensor, coolant temperature. As I said, I'm using the metric because it's more accurate. Integrate temperature, ignition advance, short fuel trim, long fuel trim, one and two. Both banks, vehicle speed, fuel system is open. You got the two sensors. Before and after catalyst. 
Okay, so let's go back up. Let's go back up. Start the car. The good thing about this is it also shows you the graph. Well, again, your spin is 12, around 1285, 1290. Push enter, and it's going to calculate the calculate the graph parameters. A little chilly today in Southwest Florida. Finally, a little rain. sensor calculated off showing 7.06 grams per second coolant temperature 23 degrees is right now integer temperature ignition timing short fuel trim Speed fuel system is closed. O2 sensors. Great little tool. It shows you graph on every single sensor. I just don't get it by. Uh, Every other car has a calculated load around 2, 3, 4, 5. This one got a 29, 27, 25 from the factory. Alright, so here's all the sensors. You can also record data, view freeze frame data. And this is where the thing is good. I'm going to show you the code connect for a P0445. Just put code connect and it's going to tell you the top reporter fix. Replace vapor management valve. Frequent reporter fixes tighten fuel cap. And the thing is, it, it needs a fuel, a uh, new fuel cap. Canister solenoid, evaporator emission system. Go tell you everything. Top reporter fixes. Also, fuel tank pressure sensor. Power tray control model eh? tells you everything. Also, report to fix it. Repair all vacuum hoses, eh? canister, ta -da -da, ta -da -da. that's it. Dry cycle monitor, catalyst is incomplete, and EVAB is incomplete. Auto monitor test doesn't want to do that. Onboard systems, vehicle information is, is only on, I think, 2000 and up. Models present and review data, print data, code lookup. It's a good thing too. If you got a code, you just put it in and I'm gonna tell you the definition. For example, P0455. Gross leak. I mean it's got a big leak. System set up and that's it. Okay, let's let's turn the engine off. Let's go. Let's go back. I got it. And I want to raise the code, okay? Let's go to ninety-eight sable. Some people say uh, after reading the reviews, you know that the tool is no good. Of course, it's not good if you don't know what you're doing. Don't uh, waste your money. Otherwise, it's a great tool. Okay, let's go back. Let's go to 
Red codes. Go to global OBD. Pending is still pending. Go to erase codes. It's gonna show you. Are you, are you sure you want to erase results and code? I said yes. Turn key on. Enter. Now let's go to all of the above. Tell you common send code remaining zero. Uh, let's go back to read code. Let's go to all of the above. No calls found. Everything is cleared up. After you can also put your batteries over here in the back. Four AAA batteries. Then come with it and store it in memory. After I disconnect it, disconnect the tool got a memory yeah? and you go to review data and it tells you everything you just did monitors systems DTC codes no codes funds because I erased them OBD check recording freeze data it's stored in the memory in a scanning tool everything 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 so that's it. Great little tool. Also got a blue LED display at night and it got a USB you know but it's useless because they still didn't come up with the software for the Windows 7. People complaining that it you can only use it on XP you know but uh, you don't need a computer because everything is built in. So that's it for today. And thanks for watching. Also the car is for sale. You get hundred and eight thousand miles. Twenty-five cash. Interior is pretty clean, but that's for a uh, next time.